long athletic front court that can put some pressure on the ball, but a three-pointer is good from Addy Budnick. And take an extra year and all that, but those two are seniors, and as far as we know, playing their last home game. Uh, Squires with a stop and spin. It's a five-point game. Klimkowitz against Jeremiah. You can see that pressure Rams defense. Spiders with another three. Right now it's the Spiders with a tough defense as Fordham having a tough go early. Two of five from the floor, and Grace Townsend lays it in. Being 40% from the floor. Ryan the hesitation drive and lays it in. That's going to bring about a Fordham timeout as Stephanie Gates. Skip pass to Klimkowitz. Through the lane with that left hand again, and that's the first bucket for Klimkowitz, and the spider run continues. Townsend up the floor against Flood. Swing it to Klimkowitz in the corner. Good for three. Wow. Boy, oh boy. Oh one. Back out to Budnick. Squires down low, rolls around to Wolf, and another bucket. Stephanie Gately might have to call us as if, what is going on? Townsend at the other end. And again, a whistle and a timeout. Fordham can afford to wait. No is open, but can't connect this time. Budnick keeps it alive for a Klimkowitz corner three that's good. So it's Kate Klimkowitz with no good. It's another spider rebound. And Fordham only has three offensive rebounds to this point, while Grace Townsend now with eight points. Kind of just the psychology of this. Ryan is off. Got her own rebound, though, and put it in. What great play from Ryan. Play. Oh, great hustle play by Siobhan Ryan. So often. Points a game. Yeah, they'll have to maybe try to get more possessions than usual. Speaking of quick. Whoa. Grace Townsend explodes. Ten points already. Raiders come out with it. Katie Hill pushes ahead to Ryan. Throws it to Klimkowitz. Driving in. There goes the left hand again. Kate Klimkowitz. What really a physical game. The Spiders are out physicaling Fordham. Yeah, Budnick had the matchup there against Dingle. They rolled off the screen. Bad first half. Now, if you're Richmond right now, Craig, the half is winding down as Budnick drives, steps through defenders and lays it in. 12 for Budnick. I started. The now let's see what Fordham does defensively. Of course, the other part of that, Anna DeWolf was one for 10 in the first half, and that didn't help the cause either as Grace Townsend to double-double. And a career high in rebounding, I think. Or maybe it matches a career high. Townsend through the lane and one. And it continues for Grace Townsend. I'm not going to miss. Townsend kicks in the corner. A spin by Ryan. And Ryan with another good move. That's six for Siobhan Ryan as well. It sure has. Klimkowitz at the free throw line. Good. The jumper over Caitlin Downey. And Klimkowitz has 12 she now. She gives up a little size trying to guard Siobhan Ryan there in the paint. And in this matchup right here with Ryan backing her down. Boy, we thought Wolf, DeWolf might be the match. Budnick inside. Wow. Tough position. And Jeremiah can't stop Budnick, who now. Men's basketball team here at Richmond. And two other sons are coaching in the NBA with the Heat and the Hornets. Squires again. And it's a broken record. Difficult, but from the basketball perspective, losing those two home games is, is not easy. Boy, Townsend finds a spot in the lane, up to 18. Let's see if the Spiders decide to just slow it down a little bit. Maybe nope. not. <laughs> Grace Townsend has to give it up. Shot clock is down to 10 as Townsend works on the perimeter. Into the lane, got past the defender and laid it in. Mile on her. There goes Townsend. Out to Ryan in the corner. Budnick for three. And it's good. Oh, boy. The collective heart rates of these two teams, the way they're playing. and Townsend off to Wolf and a bucket. And Townsend ever expanded.